a Cantabrian who's willing to help, contributing a collection of photographs which are on display at a busy shopping mall in Christchurch. Preparation has been running since the start of the week, put together to sell to the public in a silent auction. Well, we've got this wonderful um, person who's agreed to donate her artworks because she's so amazed with the project. Uh, she felt that she'd like to contribute in some way, so she's um, put up all these lovely artworks for, for um, benefit to go to the pathway. Local photographer Narita Keeley has put her talent in the public eye, working alongside the Christchurch Coastal Pathway Group to help fundraise around $10 million to complete the project. The exhibit includes 15 photos displaying the seascape of the Sumner area where one part of the pathway will run and Linda believes they're heading in the right direction. And that will cover the base infrastructure but we need to raise about another 10 million to get all the amenities on the pathway. So all the shade and shelter and um, improving the um, edge of the um, estuary and stuff like that, restoration. So it's quite a lot of work to be done and um, so we are definitely in the fundraising stage trying to bring that money in. The money collected by the photo exhibit will go to help the 6.5 kilometre pathway along Subna, around Redcliffs and finishing on the Mount Pleasant coast. The Christchurch City Council has already committed nearly $10 million towards the pathway back in June 2013, helping to restore and revitalise the coastal communities. But there's more work to be done. Oh, this is wonderful. This is, um, you know, it's all these kind of things that are going to help us get there. And it's very um, uplifting for all of us volunteers as well, because so many people are on board with this project and trying to carry it through. So it doesn't rest with any particular lot of people. Everyone's trying to make this happen. There's no construction or completion date yet, but the design stage is in full swing. And the pathway is going to be done in sections, so um, they're currently working on the Redcliffe section, uh, looking at the design of that. Donations are welcome, and the public has only a few more days to view the exhibit at the Colombo Shopping Centre and purchase a picture to help turn the bigger picture into a reality. Jared McCulloch, CTV News.